the question is a traveler walks a certain distance had he gone half a kilometer however faster he would have walked it in four fifths of the time had he gone half an hour half a kilometer however slower he would have taken two and a half hours longer what is the distance what is the distance so this is a quantitative aptitude question this is a quantitative aptitude question on speed time and distance on speed time and distance now my first equation all is when it comes to speed time and distance is st will be equal to d st will be equal to d why i write always like this is i have seen lots of questions the distance has always remained constant this distance has always remained constant the manipulation takes place between speed and time manipulation takes place in speed and time and one more thing i like to tell you is when the distance is constant the speed and time are inversely proportional if the speed goes up time comes down if the time goes up speed comes down like that now what is happens is this is the usual speed and usual time taken So distance covered is as usual distance covered. Now had he gone half a kilometer, however faster means if this yes he would have travelled half a kilometer more. Supposing yes is ten, he would have walked at ten point five. So it will be yes plus point five. Half a kilometer is yes plus point five. He would have done it in four fifth of the time means normal time is t. So it will be four by five of t will be equal to t. Then the next statement is had he gone had he gone half a kilometer, however slower. So it will become s minus 0.5. It will become s minus 0.5. He will have taken two and a half hours more. T plus 2.5. More means plus. Times it I multiply it. So it will be equal to d. And the easy way, whenever in case you make some mistake, when the speed is going up, time comes down. When the speed comes down, time goes up. Like that. Understand it like that. Now, because the right hand side is equal, left hand side will be equal. Because the right hand side is equal, left hand side will be equal. So s t will be equal to. S plus 0.5, S plus 0.5 into 4 by 5 of t. Now this 5 will go there, and this t will get cancelled out. T will get cancelled out. 5s will be equal to 4s plus 2, or s will be equal to 2. Once you get s as 2, now you can't solve it using the same first and second equation. You have to use either the second and third or the first and third. First and third is easier. So I am substituting s there. So 2t will be equal to 1.5. That is 2 minus 1.5. T plus 2.5. So 2t will be equal to 1.5t plus 3.75. Or 0.5t will be equal to 3.75. T will be equal to 7.5. Now I know what is t. I know what is s. So distance in s t will be equal to t. 2 into 7.5 will be equal to 15. The answer is 15. This is the easier way of doing it. Don't complicate issues. Just ST is equal. Remember all this. Any speed time distance because this is one of the important questions that is going to come there. So ST speed time distance is a important thing. So ST will be equal to D. Then the manipulation takes place. Subscribe to my channel. I will be adding questions every now and then.